Alright guys, welcome back to Garden Warfare 2, back on the PC, if you can't hear it, <laughs> it's very loud. So, um, I finally got it to work, let's go. <laughs> so yeah, of course we're going to be playing Mr. JT's Ultimate Boss Edition. And side note about that guy, he did a really good video on how to change your FOV. I know a lot of people have been asking me, so I'll direct you to his tutorial in the uh, description. And I'll leave a link to his social media in his YouTube, because he did a fantastic job on this mod. A lot of people really like the idea of me just kind of playing some mods in like a really chill kind of video. I mean, I could do that, but I wouldn't really be content doing that. So now that I've got mods working, I'm going to try and think of something a little bit more clever than that. But for today's video, we are just going to play around because I'm just super excited I finally got it to work. This is what Trials of Nomus should have given us. Oh, that's good. It removes multiplayer. Look at the size of this lad. He's a big lad with a small lad in the back. Okay, so he just whacks. How much damage are we saying for a whack? Come here. Nothing. Oh, oh that's 50. Never mind. Uh, what we've got ability-wise, we've got an imp punt. That does 100 damage. If I die, the guy's just that good. Oh my god, this guy feels rapid. Should he be moving this fast? <laughs> Coming through. Level two, does that level me up overall? It did. Okay, <laughs> right. Uh, we're gonna change game modes because skill issue, I guess. I don't know. He can't eat me, can he? He's scared. Come on. Oh. He knew. Dead. I don't know what the attack dummy does. I'm coming for you. Mrs. Prickles, you can't... Run forever. That was even Mrs. Prickles. <laughs> I am having way too much fun. <laughs> Is that Mrs. Prickles? Can I finally exact my vengeance? She's gone. Coward. Keep using this attack dummy. No idea what it's for. That will not stand. I'm gonna get someone point blank with the imp. Like, unapologetic. There we go. <laughs> I feel accomplished. Through we go. Oh, he, I mean, to be fair, he's a hefty lad. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I forgot the level of heft I'm dealing with. Oh, you lucky boy. <laughs> I didn't even get most kills. Despite the heft. But this time we're going to play the Giga Garg. Giga Garg. I might try saying that ten times fast, I swear. Oh my god, this thing is cracked. What the hell? This thing is so good. No, not the jumper. Oh. Nailed him in the face with that. Come here. Oh. Okay, this thing's just so good. Except if you get gooped and chuck shot. That, then it kind of... There's a bit of... A bit of fall off there, you know. <laughs> That's what I like to see. Is it rapid fire? I could just hold it. Come here. Oh my, Mrs. Prickles. 
Oh, you really got to hide from these crazy bots, haven't you? Those those are the true men. Oh, my. Oh. Smasher seems the worst out of all of them. Don't say skill issue, don't you? I see you typing that comment. I see Mrs. Prickles. It's got to be Mrs. Prickles. I'm too hefty. Was it? Yes. Oh, pirate summon. That's what that does. Oh. I'm here now. Oh, that was perfect. My guy. Although I'm still going to die all the same because I'm terrible. Oh, I've just realized uh, that pirate slam did a lot of damage from a lot of distance away. I don't even have to be within like two feet of them. This is glorious. All right, we summon the boys. Come on, fellas. And now, now we attack. And of course, that I get gooped and sunbeamed as soon as it happens. But come on, boys. Push, use the momentum. Yes. <laughs> I just I need to stop doing that. Um, I don't even feature, but th those were the bosses. A blast. Like I said, information about everything you need to know in the description about Mr. JT, the fellow behind this uh, this here mod. And yeah, if you want to know how to get your FOV changed, check out that video. Very helpful. And he has a, he has a couple other guides on this channel as well, so I'll leave a link to it in the description. But yeah. Thanks a lot for watching, and hopefully by the next mods video, I should have an interesting setup and premise ready. Alright, see ya.